Welcome to Rehash. On the internet, we're all news is old news. We bring you the best and worst of what's happening today. Welcome to Rehash. My name is Matt. YouTube is per laptop. And I do main gameplay, but at the moment I'm doing moving videos. Let's go back to the main rehash episode. Thank you so much to Pyro Laptop, who's provided our intro. If you'd like to do the same, there's a link down in the description where you can provide in it's stuff. Time yeah. Yep. Um, okay, so we got a couple of news stories to deal with today. Uh, I wanted to talk to you about uh, Monopoly the movie. What did you want to talk about? In Minecraft's the story mode. Okay, cool. All right, let's uh, let's jump right into it. Let's go. Jump. Recently, it was announced that Hasbro has agreed to a Monopoly movie. Really? Which is interesting. Like, when when I heard that there was going to be a Monopoly movie, I was hoping that they'd bring, like, you know, Jim Carrey in. And, like, do you ever see Ace Ventura where he... It's Ace Ventura when nature calls? Like, the second one? No. You must be the Monopoly guy. Um, he, like, holds this guy with a top hat and monocle and everything, like, upside down. And he's like... You know, do not pass go. Do not collect two hundred dollars. Like <laughs> that, that was the image in my head. So, so what is the, like the concept behind the movie? Is it like little kids playing Monopoly? The uh, details are kind of sparse at this time. Okay. But I just thought it was really interesting that a game that, and you can Wikipedia this, was originally uh, created to demonstrate the broken nature of capitalism. Yes. Is now gonna be like a kids, like I assume kids movie. I. It could be like Battleships, that horrible movie that they, they <laughs> the, decided no, they were going to... Who is it being made? Like Pixar? Or who's making it? Um, I, I don't... Uh, Lion Gate? I, 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 could, I could be wrong. I, again, this is not hard-hitting news right. or journalism, gotcha. but there's a link down there where you could probably read and do more, you know, learning type things than what I did yeah. before. Yeah. Thanks for the free parking. Alright, so I wanted to talk to Freedom Family and you. Okay. Uh, I know you play a lot of Minecraft. Who told? No... Nobody. Okay. But I, I remember getting on, on your laptop and I got on Minecraft and I seen you had a world. And I know you, you play a little bit of it. So for the most part, you did Minecraft servers, all that good stuff. And, and I've played a lot of Minecraft. And, and something I've always wanted to see is a little backdrop, a little backstory as to like Steve and, and the characters and stuff like that. So Telltale Games, if you don't know who they are, they've made like the Walking Dead series. They made. Oh, yeah. 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 So they made all kinds of great games that you know are actually based off of whether it be a TV series, and they made Minecraft a story. It's an adventure game by Telltale Games set in Minecraft world. It is a five-part episodic series that will take you to the Nether, the Far Lands, the End, and beyond. You will drive, or you will drive how the story flows through the decisions you make, what you say to people, and how you say it, and what you choose to do in the moments in the, the thrilling action. It's going to be available soon to PC, Mac, PS3, PS4, Xbox One, 360, and compatible iOS devices. And enjoy. I have a small follow-up to that. Really? Um, uh, Microsoft slash Mojang, Mojang, however the heck yeah, you want to say it, has just announced they're also going to be doing a Windows 10 only version of Minecraft. Now, is it going to be up to date? Is it going to be like consistent with the updates? From what I understand, um, they're going to uh, bring this into, um, like, they're going to start with the console version, and then they're going to port over everything from the Java version of Minecraft into this port. What else is it? So is it going to be free, or you always have to pay Anyone who currently owns Minecraft as of the launch will be able to have it. Awesome. And then uh, after that, it'll be like a $10 download while it's in beta. And yeah. yeah that's, that's similar how it was to 360 to Xbox One. Kind of similar. Mm. All right. Um. That. That. that, that did you have any more music type things? Well, that, that's yeah, it. Yeah. Okay. Answer. Cool. Well, I guess that means that we get to move on to the yeah. comments. Comment number one comes from XX Code Boss XX Gaming and then a trademark symbol. So he's really official. Oh, nice. Yeah, man, he's official. He says, "On a scale from one to ten, what is your favorite color of the alphabet?" Hashtag random comment. Hashtag rehash. Hmm. Waffle. Waffle. I'm actually not following the trend, so I really don't know. I'm gonna say blueberries. Okay. All right. Next comment. <laughs> D man, E man, or Demonamon. Not sure which one that <laughs> one is. Says, and I quote: "Freedom sucks. There was a YouTuber named the Z Rhino, and you guys didn't pay him his well-earned money. So, blank you guys, and go die in a hole, you scrub bags." Oh my. God. As far as this goes, there's a lot more wow. to that story that you aren't aware of. Unfortunately, um, due to PR concerns and basically not really wanting to reopen a toxic situation, all I'm going to say is that there's a lot more to that story that he has not told. 
So um, I, I suggest that, uh, that that you dig a little bit deeper, because the truth is out there. But it's not it's not proper if it comes from me. Uh, so yeah, we have more comments. Yeah, the next comment comes from Demesh Demesh Mesh Mesh. She says, "Have you ever seen a unicorn poke you head with its horn and say you are chose?" I have. Random comment. Okay. Yeah. I'm. Is this like, <laughs> like, freeze tag with unicorns? I'm not sure what this I'm is. I'm just curious. Have you ever seen a unicorn poke you head? I've never poke you head anything, so I'm not following. I'm not a unicorn, but there now you go. We know. All right. <laughs> All right. Now comes my favorite part of the episode: the part where we talk about our partner. Hey. Pyro Laptop. Now this is a channel that at first I didn't think was going to really. Be much of anything, and I'll be honest there. Um, sitting at about 130 some odd subscribers, uh, Pyro Laptop actually kept me entertained for a few minutes while I was watching his videos. He does a lot of stuff, uh, everything from like Attack of the B Team, um, other miscellaneous Minecraft stuff. He does unboxings, he does like tutorial style videos. He seems like he keeps a really good balance of content that's going to do well in search and content that's going to. Um, hopefully appease his audience. I, I, I like his thumbnails, and I, I don't like them. Like, the thumbnails are good, I, I don't like the text. If I could suggest anything, maybe switch up the text a little bit, maybe use some gradients, but for the most part, I really like the guy's thumbnails. Like, he has, like, his little, uh, Minecraft character in the top left. Mm -hmm. He has his username. I also like the, the fact that he's using white yeah. to, to make everything else pop. Like, right. it looks like it blends in with the, the actual YouTube light. Yeah, yeah. yeah, YouTube actual, you know, page thing. So I, I like his thumbnails. I mean, like, they're, 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 you know, bright poppy, but if I could suggest anything again, it's just maybe change the, the text or the, the gradients or something like that to make it pop a little bit more. Yeah. That's just my thing. Actually, I'm really curious what some of his videos are, like the past paper questions. Do you know what they are? They're questions about past papers. Really? Moving on! Just as a side note, I would like to say that this episode has been short. Longer-ish episodes will be coming later. This is not necessarily something we're looking to do on a permanent basis. But, that being said, Till next time, don't forget to like, subscribe, and do all those things and make us love our jobs. And Zack Sykes is weird. Sometimes. Also be a all they also be awesome to yourself and amazing to each other. Bye, Freedom Family. Alright. You can stop now. That looks kinda dirty. <laughs> <laughs>